Investigators are still trying to figure out why a grill exploded this morning, injuring a mom and her teenage daughter. Now, this happened at the Oaks of Woodland Park Apartments off Waters Avenue. Now, Jason Beisel spoke with some family members and an Army vet who helped pull the mother and daughter to safety. It happened so fast. Crumbled pieces of cement and mangled piping. All that's left after a grill exploded this morning at the Oaks of Woodland Apartments. I, I couldn't think straight. I was shaking. Alize Longmire was hanging out at the pool with family and friends, cooking out to celebrate her 17th birthday. But everything changed after Longmire's mother, Dana Bresna, started putting food on the grill. She went to put the meat and stuff on it and it exploded in her face and they flew back. Bresna and her 13-year-old daughter, both throwing a few feet back. I, I mean, it was wafting, wafting with uh, petroleum. Clay Nice was heading to work, but first stopped by a friend's apartment near the pool. And as soon as I walked in, I heard a blast just like I did, you know, like overseas, like straight, like IED. An Army vet who served in Afghanistan, Nice's military training kicked in. He ran over, jumped the fence, and went into action. Pulled everybody aside, got everybody out of there. Carrying Bresna and her daughter away from the explosion. Both of them in shock, you know. Uh, reassuring them they're going to be okay. Bresna has a broken wrist and a few burns to her thigh. Fire investigators believe the explosion was caused by a small leak or human error, but are still investigating. As for Longmire, her birthday present, a miracle her mother and sister are okay. My mom uh, made sure she said, make sure I have the best birthday today. Jason Beisel, ABC Action News. We're taking action for you tonight to help keep your family safe during all of those summer barbecues. First, only use propane and charcoal grills outside and never leave them unattended. Make sure you keep pets and children away from the barbecue area. And lastly, make sure you check your propane tank hose for leaks before using the grill and let coals cool completely when you are done cooking.